the unusual trapezoidal envelope generator on the original VCS-3 was something of a head-scratcher, particularly for synthesists who'd only been exposed to the familiar ADSR envelope generators used by Moog, Arp, and others. To understand how it works, we can compare its behavior to the familiar ADSR as applied to amplitude. An ADSR envelope works by providing control over time and level. The first stage, attack, determines how long it takes the envelope to achieve full volume once a note has been triggered. The decay stage determines the length of time the envelope will take to go from full volume of the attack stage to the steady state volume of the note when the note is held. This steady state level is called sustain. Unlike the other stages, sustain is a level setting rather than a time parameter. When the note is released, say when a key on a keyboard is released, the envelope will begin its release stage. The release determines how long it takes for the sound to go from the sustained level to the initial level, usually silence. The EMS-style trapezoid envelope generator also has four stages, but only one, attack, behaves as you'd expect it to if you are only accustomed to the ADSR variety. On the EMS sense and ZILS 3CM, the other three stages are on, decay, and off. Attack behaves normally. When applied to volume level, it determines the time it takes to go from the initial level usually silence, to full volume once a note is triggered. The on stage is sort of like sustain on a traditional ADSR envelope in that it controls a steady state. However, the on parameter controls the length of time that the envelope will play at full volume. It is not a level control and has nothing to do with how long you hold a note. The envelope generator will complete its full on period once the note is triggered, regardless of, say, how long you hold down a key on your keyboard. The next stage is decay. This is not at all the same as the decay stage of a traditional ADSR, but instead behaves like an ADSR's release stage, in that it determines how long the envelope will take to transition from the full volume of the completed on stage to silence. The EMS style envelope is a looping envelope. The off stage determines the length of time it takes the envelope generator to re-trigger between a completed decay cycle and a new attack cycle. When the off knob is set to fully clockwise, the envelope will not re-trigger. A wide range of interesting patterns and rhythms may be created using an envelope generator such as the trapezoid, and this envelope greatly benefits from the fact that its decay stage is available as a modulation target in the pin matrix. Download over 30 exclusive plugins. Get hundreds of pro quality samples and power up your production skills with in depth tutorials. We break it down for you step by step, and you'll see exactly how it's done in expert video guides and producer masterclass sessions with pro producers. Get all this and more with Computer Music Magazine every month on iPad and iPhone, PC and Mac, Android, and in print.